So this video now show how can you do consolidated e-invoice. First, go to Malaysia e-invoice, consolidated e-invoice. Click new and select the date range of invoices, which you would like to do consolidate. And then click OK. A summary will appear. How do I know what are the records? You can actually click on view. It will show you this particular invoice. When I click on create, it will then perform the submission. You can see here, this one is by document type invoice. So I click view, refresh e-invoice status. You can see the status become valid. Now we can go to our My Invoice portal. You can see the consolidated e-invoice over here. We can click into the consolidated e-invoice. As you can see, we will put in the general public team number and there is no BRN. You can also see the details as below. Moving back to auto count, we can also go back to sales invoice. We can actually click column chooser and find something called consolidated e-invoice document number. You can drag this out and you will realize there will be a document number over here. You can see for this particular invoice, you have performed the consolidated and it will appear right here. So this is how you can do consolidated e-invoice in AutoCount.